One of the other properties that had a, um, a hermit uh, is Paynes Hill near, near London, um, which at one point became a wreck. The Canadian army occupied it during the Second War and ran tanks all over it. But it has been lovingly restored by a, a local trust uh, and is now a magnificent property to visit. And one of the things that has been restored is the hermitage, which has been erected in the same spot um, based on the drawings of the original hermitage at Paynes Hill. Um, Mr. Hamilton was one of those who advertised for uh, a hermit, uh, presumably using handbills, as there are many uh, accounts of the advertisement, but I've not been able to find it in any newspaper of the, of, of the period. But he too was looking for someone um, who would, uh, would, would grow, grow a beard and not wash and, 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 uh, and not, not cut his hair and all the rest of it. And he seems to have found someone and I was eventually able to track down um, who he was, although he ended his days, sadly enough, in what we would now call a, a psychiatric hospital. How he lost his, his post isn't clear, but the story that goes back to the early days is that after a few weeks as a hermit, he was found in the local pub and hermits weren't allowed to, uh, to, to go to the pub. Um, that story has been gradually elaborated uh, over the years, so it now includes improper relations with a milkmaid, for example, and this is a series of, of, of heinous crimes eventually led to his dismissal as a hermit. And this was always a very serious business, as, as getting a replacement hermit uh, w was never entirely um, easy. In the event, because of the payment system, he didn't stay for the seven years that was required to, uh, to, to collect his, his, his pay. And in any case, even if he had uh, stayed out of the pub and kept away from milkmaids, uh, he couldn't possibly have collected his money because Mr. Hamilton, who owned the estate, went bankrupt. So he wouldn't have been paid anyway.